Hey guys! I have avoided making a video for quite some time. I've actually made, videotaped a couple, I edited one, and then I was like, no. Not, not doing it. Okay, so, um, I told you guys I was going to videotape at a concert, and I keep forgetting. I'm going to try to remember to do the June 8th one. I can't promise anything, though. I'm going to try, but I'm not promising anything. Okay? Um, if you're wondering what band I'm talking about, they're called Until the Wind Shifts. Their link will be below. You should check them out. They're awesome. Anyway, the point of this video, I decided I want to show you guys my book collection because I have nothing better to do. And I have a lot of books. Yeah, so, let's get started, right? This is my beautiful bookshelf. Can't really see that bottom shelf too well because there's a bunch of shit down there. Bam! Look at all those old books. Old books right there. Um, school books, learning books, random books and book covers. My Lord of the Rings books. More, ignore that. More learning books, mostly languages. Um, I have Latin, more Latin old books. I got French. English, Russian, Grey's Anatomy, because it's all for the DSM-4. Those are all my learning books and my random books, right? Okay, so I have two main, or three main sections on my bookshelf. I have my old classics. These are all classics. Um, well, mostly. Uh, Necromicon, I don't know if that's really a classic. To Kill a Mockingbird, my favorite book on the shelf because it's the prettiest one that I have. Grimm's Fairy Tales, Northanger Abbey, Jane, Your Little Woman, Wizard of Oz, and Peter Pan. Then over there, yeah, Tale of Two Cities, Moby Dick, Winnie the Pooh, Walden. Then, I'm not going to read those. This one, the one at the top though is Hamlet. I know you can't read that because it's kind of my granddad's copy. And then I have all these titles. I have not read all of them. I have Lord of the Flies. I didn't know that I bought that. Oh, snap. You learn something new every day. I almost bought that book last time I went to the bookstore, but apparently I already have it. So those are my classics. Aren't they so pretty? I'm adding to it. I don't know. Okay, so these books, you can't see any of them. Just give me one second, though. So in one pile... I have, you know, Perks of Being Wallflower, a random book I got from convention. These books. I have two, two books right here. I actually have another one. My favorite book ever is 13 Reasons Why by Jay Asher. I adore it. And these two are really good books too, right? Um, I have the series. The other one's right there. Then I have these books by Ellen Hopkins, but I've also read Crank, Glass, Fallout, and I used to have one of her other books. Um, it was a red one. Okay. Then in this lovely pile is my Maximum Ride series. Every single one of them. If you haven't read this series, check it out. It's absolutely amazing. Like, James Patterson writes amazing adult books. He also writes amazing, like, teenager books. Then in my last pile, but I have this. It's, you know, that series by Linda Bray. Um, yeah. A Great and Terrible Beauty, Rebel Angels, and The Sweet Far Thing. Really good books based in, like, the late 1800s. And then, of course, er, Twilight. This is part of my music collection. Um, that's just part of it. The other half of it, actually the other three quarters of it, are in the living room. These are all my mom's books, except for this one and this one. There's this one I picked out myself. Flute books, because I play the flute. More music. Scrapbook. Old music books. Composing book. That's not even all, though. These are two books that I found in my attic. This is a 1993 edition. This is a 1976 edition. 
two cute books to add to my shelf, which I have yet to add to my shelf. This one's for me. I got it the other day. This is my other John Green book, which I got the other day. I have to read it before I put it on the shelf. And this one. Shh. This is a present for my daddy. Shh. Leather bound. I need to take the wrapper off. But yeah. Beautiful leather bound. I adore them. Okay, so. But. Those are all of my books. I'm running out of room on my bookshelf. I need a new bookshelf. So bad. Because look at this. These are only the books that I have up here. Right? These are the books that I have on here. These are the books that I don't have on there. These, those are your books. And those are books that I want to save for my children. Maybe I should be afraid. And those are just really old books. And then those are anime. Manga. I meant manga. Well, there's some anime, but manga. This is my new and improved fixed bookshelf. That hasn't changed. This did. You can actually see them. This is my to read stack of books along with, you know, them written down in my absolutely horrible handwriting along with the book that I'm currently reading. Yes. So, yeah, um, that's my book collection pretty fabulous. It's pretty big. And I'm only hoping to get it bigger. If you have any suggestions for books you think I should read or check out, um, put them down in the, put them down in the comments. Yeah. That would be fabulous. Um, because if you think I'm missing anything, I have a list that I lost of books I want to get. Which includes most of the classics, but not all of them. So if you think that I'm missing something, need to add something to my collection, you should definitely comment. I would appreciate that a lot. Bye.